Hey what's up guys, Sam News, we're going back to another video and today is episode 3 or season 3 of Vancouver Canucks franchise mode so if you want to, so if you didn't see last video um, here are, are our lines, so we signed Patrick Kane to um 4 year 11.275 million dollar deal so yeah, um we also got like Timoshov, this guy so they're all just like like I got like a fourth line guys. Um Radish is now um E two, which is good. Best is an E seven. Best has had some pretty good seasons. Like I mean this season especially was really good. Um Ropey Hints, of course we traded him for Um Horvat. We also got Yamamoto. Oh was Yamamoto we traded for Garland. Uh, we got Yamamoto because he had a cheaper contract, but, um, we have Hughes and Parenko, which is unfortunately zero. We have Smith and Morrissey and Yovlani and Bowden. For goalies, we have Demko's in the 87 and Saros as our, ba as our backup. Um, for special teams, this is our first unit. It's actually really good, like, I really love our first unit. Um... I want Pedersen to be on the wing, but Clay Keller doesn't have good face-offs, and like neither does Kane. Kane is the like best. I want him on the wing as well. I mean, I could like put hints on here, but who would I take out like hints for who? Or even Dickinson in that first unit, but nah, it's alright. Um, four-man player play zero. The penalty kill is actually really good. I should want Hughes on the first penalty kill. Uh, it's plus three, but I'd rather have plus one. Yeah, um. Also, Pearson off first. Penalty Pearson on the first. So, Pearson and Hintz. Uh, maybe two Swedes together? No. no actually, I'm gonna. For a line, I'm, I wanna put the. Pearson then. If I did that. Yeah, probably not a smart idea. No. Uh, we signed Nick Wall, yeah, as well. Okay, anyways, if you want to see our AHL team, it's also pretty good. Like, our AHL team's actually sacked. Look at this. I'm gonna... Yeah, I can't fix this, or... Yeah, I can't really fix this part yeah I can't really fix this I don't know who's messing it up but yeah no matter what I do I can't really fix it oh well actually I could fix it but then uh, some, uh that's a problem it's okay I'll just leave it so just Julian Gother who was selected in the first round Carolina already gave him up um so he's an 80 Chaplick's an 80 for defense no one's an 80 but Hinola and Rathbone I really do want them to grow. Hinola is younger than Rathbone, so I think Rathbone making this the the team next year. Two solid seasons in the in the age of. For goalies, D Pietro's an actually an eighty two and Primo's an eighty one. So probably next year I'm gonna get rid of um Saros. Not gonna be signed him. So um this probably just him to the book. Okay, so it's, um I don't really want no, I don't want to do no, I don't want. Hey, is, is DiPietro on the trade block? Yes, he is. All right. I, for trade block, um, I put. Oh yeah, I forgot Edvinson's as well. All right. So, oh, hints I got got higher in value. Wait, how did he do with us last season? Oh, he wasn't with us. Off season deal, I forgot. Or was he? Yeah. Besser, okay. I expect him to have higher. Um, I'm just gonna put Dickinson. Dickinson, Saros. Um.
just now to leave it when else I'm just leaving untouched. Hanola, third, fourth, and fourth for Schulten and third. No, thank you. Um. Well, something I did forget to do. I'm gonna quickly do it. Quickly with this. Um. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Uh, something I did forget to do. Since we traded Horvat, I'm gonna have to. Okay, Paris has to see Besser and Kane both have they. All right, that's that's good. So also, I'm gonna be doing something new. So I'm not gonna be um. I'm not gonna be like showing the off season anymore. Like I'm not gonna be doing the off season on camera. I'll do the all off camera because I know it takes too long. And like if you see my last two videos, they take like a really long time. They're over an hour each, almost. Uh, hour and a half so so I'm gonna just not do the off season I'll show you the uh, how I did what I did during the like I'll show you what our team looks like next uh, the video after but I'm just not gonna show the off season so yeah by the way we aren't doing that well with third actually teams are five and two Two straight losses is not very good. Hmm. So all I'm gonna be showing is the draft and then the resigning phase, but then not the actual off season. Oh, okay. Dickinson has six for Mata. What? What overall is he? <sighs> Only 81. I kind of wish it was a bit more. What else do they have? Yeah, I don't know. Just leave it. Nine, five, and one. Okay. Seattle's ten and six. All right. All right. I like the way our team's playing. Okay, we've lost the last three. Okay, we win. Um, but yeah, um, I really enjoy making these franchise modes, so if you guys also enjoy, I know I have, like, no views, but, like, still. I have learned that the thing with YouTube is patience. All you need is patience, and eventually, you shall get what you want. You shall be on people's recommended. Just patience. Patience is all you need. So I am being patient. And besides, I don't really care. It's fun. Making these videos is actually really fun. And sure, whatever happens, happens. Okay. Let's see. We're second in the Pacific, I think. Let's see, let's quickly, let's quickly see the Pacific. We're third now. Pacific's always tight, like, I don't understand why. Like, I don't think it's as tight this year. I can see the flames the strikes are last, but... They're decently, they're decently close, so... Even the IRL. Like, IRL, Pacific's always tight. Like, I actually hate it, as a Canucks fan. Ah, it's so much stress. I'm not going to do that trade. That's a bad trade. But, ah, it's so much stress. Only, at least, only, like, the max only five teams can make it in the, in the playoffs. I don't want to trade Hanoa. But, yeah. Um, we're first now. That is very nice. Oh, it looks like this time, I don't think it's as close as before. I mean, from, like, last place and everything. We just lost two streets. Uh, 
I think I think I'll be able to trade Saros at the deadline. Some team's gonna want him at the deadline. Like some team that needs like a goalie, like a backup, is gonna want him. It looks like we're second. Oh, it's a three-way. Oh, we have to win. It's a three-way tie for that second spot, and the Oilers are right behind. Hmm. We might get 50 wins. Um, that's a very low chance. I think we can get 40 wins. We can just kind of run away in the Pacific Division, which I am hoping for. Uh, I do not want to make a trade. I do not want Beagle back either. We are second right now in the Pacific. We are... Calgary's tied with us, okay. We're tied for first. We're three-way tied for first, looks like. We are now in first. Okay, we're 35, 21, and 6. Clayton Keller is leading our team and scoring with a point over a point, just over a point a game. So we're 76 points. Look at this. Three way, t um, three way tie for second. And the Edmonton's right there. So Golden Knights, Kraken, and Sharks, they're decently close. Um, So we look at where we're, we're right now second in the Pacific. Or second in the um, in Western, and I want to maybe sixth in the whole NHL. So if we do, I didn't want to do that. Um, so if you just as curious as me, you just want to see the stats. This is Keller that you saw. Pedersen seems to be more of a playmaker. I'm totally alright with that. And Kane, um, putting up very good numbers, by the way. Besser, Oza, I'm also very happy with his, produ with his production. Very good player, one of my favorite players on the Canucks. Hints, having another, having a very good season. And the Yamamoto, who's also having a good season. Do we have a sniper on? We have a two, he's a two way, Besser's a sniper. All right, this, so Radish has gone up to an 83. This is very good, more points than last season. So I want him from up to the, th the fourth, the first line, but no point. Dickinson having a good season as well. I might I, I might just keep him. I don't know though. Having a good season. He's a good he's plays he plays on the penalty kill. He has decent defensive awareness. His shots okay. His power at least. His hands also decent. Hoglander also no, once again having another good season. I like Hoglander. Hoglander is another one of my favorite players on the Canucks. Timashov, yes, yes, yes. Um, he'll probably stay on our fourth line. Sampe, I don't think I'll bring him back. Depends how he grows this season. Nick Watt, same. I don't know if he'll bring him back. But defense, Hughes having a good season. Parenko, defense, but still doing good. Hughes is a plus 31, by the way. Um, Morrissey, still an 86, plus 16. Smith as well. Bowden, who doesn't really ever sim well, but... Hopefully he still does. And then Yovlani, in terms of goalies, Saros. His numbers are actually decently well, decently good. Um, they're pretty good actually. And then Demko having very good numbers. Um, so let's just see trade deadline. I'm going to be a conservative buyer. Um, ooh, so Larkin's available. Lindholm. Bobrovsky. Gustafson. Okay. Marcheseau. Dumba. Spurgeon. Mantha. Meyer. And Burnett's. Decent. Meyer, I am interested, but you're going to you're gonna have to be signed. So let's see, um, how much cash space do we have? Alright, so I think I'm gonna trade Saros to some team that needs him. Boston and Buffalo both seem to be trying to make the playoffs. They only have, uh, so they don't really have, I could get a bit more for than I'm asking for for him. Um, like, oh, Nick Ritchie, I see. Taylor Hall, okay. 
Andre Kasha, he they both swimming really well. How they get more cider? What? Charlie Coil. Um. Brandon Carlo, he where would he fit? On that third line, he'd be taking Bojan's spot. So no thanks. Three million dollars for fourth line defense as well. No thank you. Trent Frederick, I kind of want him. Where would he fit? On the third line? Uh, let me think. Uh, no, nah, I'm good. Grizzly, uh, Eric Chernak. Where would he fit? Third pairing as well. He's a defensive defenseman. This nothing. Galchenia, do they have? I mean, maybe I'll try to get a prospect like um this mark. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I'll try to get maybe it's Fredrick and then I'll send him down to the AHL. All right, so maybe uh, maybe I could get a bit more. Maybe just a six. All right, a uh, one for one goalie for player. Let's go over to Seattle. See how Seattle's doing. Is this Toronto? Toronto's Matthews and Marner. Um. Nicholas Robertson. Oh, he's having a good season. Well. Oh, he sold two seasons. Of, where, where would he fit if I tried to get him? Third line. Uh, he take Wasp. Raw spot. Dennis Mulligan. Also, having oh wow, two really good seasons. Nice. All right, Robertson. Robertson for Wiz Bowden. I wanna trade a Bowden. There we go. Bowden and uh should I trade him? Maybe not. Bowden and Timashov. Bowden and Timashov for Robertson. Maybe give one, maybe give something else. Wah as well. Bowden, Timoshov, and Bowden. Bowden, Timoshov, and Wah for Robertson. Okay. Giving a lot of really low. <laughs> Lots of very low overall guys. This is Kagi's fourth as well. Okay. And our seventh. Five items. Calgary and Calgary's fourth and our fourth. Come on. You say no to that? Uh, something with both of those in a second. <gasps> Alright. So we got. Okay. Good enough to fix these lines, but. We got. Robertson for actually a pretty good price. We gave Bowden, who I hopefully doesn't end up simming well. Um, I could trade Morsi next, but I actually like Morsi. Well, I mean, I don't like him, but like, I like him on team. He's playing good, thirty points average. He plays a lot of minutes. He has good defensive awareness. He has good. He's good defense. His skating's also pretty good. Um, his shot's pretty good as well, like, at least his power, he has good power. Uh, his offensive awareness is even pretty good. And even his passing and foul control, that's also good, so I'd like to keep him. Parenko, I'm very happy so with Parenko. Yes, I've said that. Um. Go. 
goalies. Demko has a lot of value. Okay, so he is 87. So looks like that's what he'll be at. 87 overall. And then DPS to right, right behind it. And Primo Sealable or Peric. This Peric guy, he hopefully will take over. I think I can trade Silvo. Team, some team's gonna want him. There we go. Call it New York Islanders. Fred Rick Anderson. Okay, I can get some rookie skater. Okay, I said my rookie. Okay. I have to trade. I'm gonna have to trade one of our prospects. Edmonton's the highest. Okay. Um. Rathbone? No, I don't want to trade. Boom! You're getting all three of those guys. Hmm. Come on, you're getting so much. And I'll give you a seventh and a sixth. Well, seventh and a fifth, maybe? Come on, you're getting so much. A fourth. A fourth and a sixth. You really don't want to trade him, do you? Two fourths. What's per okay, third. A third and fourth. Okay, they don't really, really don't want to trade him. Okay, well the only team that wants all three is New York, is New York, so I'll find something. Like this guy. Um, Pew Suter. No thanks. Give you Silvo. Okay. Wait, who even is this guy? Like for real? Okay, there we go. I could try to get the two Hughes brothers together. I do not have Luke Hughes, so I can't get all three Hughes together. But I could. He fit on the first first line. I could. <laughs> hear me out here. I could trade him for Patrick Kane. Him for Kane. Come on. I like the trade. You guys are getting the legendary Patrick Keane in this deal. I think, but I'll take also Michael McLeod. Or, mm, maybe something a bit lower value. Uh, okay. I am a crazy man who makes crazy trades, and that was one of them. Blockbuster trade. Our future set. Kane's gonna retire soon. But then we have our future. 
We got both hues. Let's go. Let's go. And we also got um Michael McLeod, who will fit in our definitely not the fourth lines. Okay. Do we maybe we should trade for some defense now? Or okay, let's look at the defense. Who's making who's going? Hughes, Perenko, Morrissey, Yovel. Oh, and the third pair can just be Rathbone. Okay. I'm done for trade deadline. All right. Some Gagne decline. Other lines. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I didn't know he. <laughs> My four death is too good. I have too many fours. That Hoglander is not gonna. Okay. I'm sorry you guys are on the fourth line, but it has to be like this. So, um... Let's cue the playmaker. Okay. This is now on that third line. Hughes and Perenko. Yo, Blady and Morrissey and Smith and Rathbone. Okay. Alright. Scratched. Saw and pay. Okay. Goalie. Okay. And Di Pietro. Hopefully he doesn't get taken on waivers, but if he does, it is what it is, whatever. He didn't. That's very good. Okay, Jonah Gazvich. If he, hopefully he seems better. He has to seem better. Second round pick, only 77 overall. For goalies, we have Premium and Perrick. Our team's insane. Okay, but first, hopefully you can... You know, hopefully we can, like, you know... Stay first. We lost against Vegas. <gasps> oh no, that's a first game. Oh no, 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 no. We made, we got better for death. Like, we trade Kane and Star, but we also got Jack Hughes, piece of the future, and Michael McLeod, another piece of the future. We trade a piece for the now, a piece of now for a piece of the future. Like, the oldest player on our team is probably like Perenko, I think. Um, but no, no, not Perenko. Wait, no, I'm off by a lot. Not Perenko. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to see. Maybe, um, our team's really young. Oh, we're losing a lot of games. Please don't be like this. But, uh, keep us in first. We don't even have 100 points. Yeah, we made the playoffs. Yeah. We win the last game of the season as well. Let's see who leads the points. Pedersen. Yeah, we got Pedersen. But first, we should see. The AHL's team's insane. 
Let's see. Patterson. Okay, then Keller. Best with 44 goals. Okay, let's see how many points the Hughes have with us. 12 points. Uh, that's not bad. Hence, yeah, I'm all Quinn Hughes. How many points did Robertson have with us? Eight? Okay. He fits best on... Okay. Michael McCall. How many points did he have with us? Thirteen. Okay, not bad. I like you like that. Okay. Oh, Frederick. What did he have with us? Two goals only with us. Okay. Rathbone zero. Okay. Who's a rookie this season? Rathbone. Not really a rookie. Um, okay, Demko. Probably most likely. Oh, Philip Gustafson. Okay. For um, Kucherov. Oh wow, it's not even 100 points this season. Matthews with the Rocky Richard. Um, defenseman. Dowdy. Okay, Seth Jones with Tang Hedman. Shabbat Carlson. Hughes is somewhere here. Yeah, Hughes. Okay. Let's see where we finished. First, of course. Entire league. St. Louis was first. Okay, Columbus. We are, oh, we're seventh. Okay. Yeah, let's see about goals faced. Oh, Carolina. We're, okay, we're, we're fourth. What goals against? Let's do We're third. Okay. That's, that's good. Point percentage. Okay, we're seven. Okay, we're against Chicago. Yeah, let's win against Chicago. Game one, we win one nothing. Game two, we lose two one. Both at home. Now we're in Chicago. Game three, we win five one, and game four, we also we win three zero. We can take Chicago out. Let's do it. We lose four one. Let's take them out in Chicago. Uh, come on. Okay, we win 5-4 in OT. Very nice. Alright, we're seeing LA Kings. Alright, game 1 and 2 are both at home. Let's see. We lose and then we win in overtime. The game 3 and 4 are away. We win 2-1 and we win 4-1. Let's go. Come on. We can take LA out. Let's go. Okay. I'm just gonna sim this. Might as well. Two one for them. Four two. Five two. Oh no. <laughs> they forced a game seven. Oh no. Come on. I believe in our team. We can get them out. Let's go to the conference finals. One nothing. Alright. Come on, come on. Power play, the score. It's a long power play. It's a five. Five minute, five on three score. Oh, oh, Nick Robertson, let's go. All right, come on, let's just hold on. We're out shooting them by so much. Come on, let's hold on. Power play, let's go, Josh Morrissey. Let's go, three nothing shout for them go, and we move on to the um the semifinals or the Western Conference final. Oh, we're versus Colorado. Oh no. Colorado's are a really good team, so like, this is not good. We win 5 4 and we win 4 3, both in OT. Now we're back home to sweep them. Let's sweep them. We lose 4 1. We win 3 2 in OT. Let's take Colorado out. Yeah, 7 0 win. We're going to the Stanley Cup finals. Yeah. Oh, we're versus Toronto. It's an all Canadian matchup. We're both 12 and 6. Okay. First game in Toronto. Let's see how we do. 2 0. Alright. 2-2, two, 3-3, two, three, three. oh, double overtime, oh, Rasmus Sandin for Toronto, okay, game two in Toronto, come on, let's tie, let's tie, let's tie, let's tie, let's tie, let's tie. two nothing for them, four one for them, four two, oh, Toronto's a powerhouse, man,
Come on, we're home. Let's win. Two nothing, alright. Still two nothing. Two one, let's go, we hold on. Okay. Alright, this game four at home. This is a big game. We have to win this. Come on. Two one. Four two. Five three. Oh uh, no. We could be knocked out here. We could be. And if we do, please don't riot fans. Hopefully the fans don't riot. Alright, two zero. Three nothing. Four one. And Toronto ends up winning the Stanley Cup. That's sad. But Toronto was a powerhouse. They had insane goal attending. Oh, Jack Hughes just under a point a game. Let's look at the playoff tree. Alright, so we, of course. Oh, so Toronto, 1 and 7, swept Tampa 1 and 7 against the Canes. And then, of course, beat us. Oh, that's, uh, but whatever. It is what it is. Alright, the Springfield Thunderbirds won the HL Calder Cup. First overall goes to Arizona, Minnesota, then Seattle, Philly, Ottawa, San Jose. Alright, nice. The retired, let's see who retired. Jumbo Joe finally calls it quits with over a thousand assists. Wait, how many points did he? He was playing, he was still playing in the NHL and he was putting up over 50 points. At 43 year olds. What? Jumbo Joe, my guy. Joe Pabelski, so close to 1,000 points. Zach Carize right behind him. James Neal, Bobby Ryan, Mark Giordano, Louis Erickson, former Canucks legend, yes. Uh, Phil P Opozo, Lad, Edler, yeah, it goes on. Goalies, let's see. Craig Anderson, Carter Hutton, Mac Lenny, alright. Staylock. Uh, this M. Roth guy, and so it goes on. Um, alright. Okay, I see. Let's see, who went first overall? This Bouchard guy. Is Bedard in this draft? Let me see. He should be in the draft if he is <gasps> he is going fifth overall i see well i know what i must do fifth overall pick i'm taking bedard you know i am i want bedard um how much is it worth okay morrissey our first Morrissey, our first and our fourth. Next year's third and fifth. What? Next year's first. I'm assuming that we make the finals again. Rejected. I'm overpaying so much. Give me Bedard now. Do you want to hire? Wait. Morrissey is just a cherry on top for you guys. What do you guys want? You guys don't even want Morrissey. Okay. Could give hints. I could. We have so much forward depth. Oh, but he did so good. Uh. Alright, let's do it. Rejected. No point. No point. They're not gonna do it. That's alright. Let's take this center. He hopefully becomes mean and shot nine. Bro. Fifty one overall as well. Not even good. Okay, hopefully this guy doesn't become bomb six. He is. 
Oh, I forgot we don't even have our second. Come on, medium top four. Seventh. This isn't a good draft. Other than like Bedard is bad. You want us to take him? All right. What's here? Bomb six. Let's see. What does he? Seventh D. I proper. Bomb six. You know I'm probably not gonna be keeping any of these guys. Gonna be letting them go. Okay. Okay. Oh, so basically all four of our coaches are gonna. Yeah, no. A my there. No, I want an A plus coach. I'm all I'm keeping is the goalie coach. Yeah, that's all I'm keeping. Quickly, um, sign all these scouts to a contract real quick. All right, good. Okay, I'm gonna have to resign a few players. Let's see who's 11 million dollars in cap space. Okay, goalies and no one. Okay, so let's see. You have Lady qualify RFA. Dickinson, who we did. That's a lot. I'm gonna have to get rid of him. Sorry. Chaplick. I'll qualify him. Gonther. Alright. Eng. One year. Okay. I'm just gonna release him. Get out of it. One year. Will Lockwood. Just one year. Pitlick. Release. Some pay. One year. Taranski. Oh, he wants a lot. Nope, I can't do that. Um, I might keep, might, shall just keep him. Keith of the future, I guess. Or not him. Yes, we get it. Scouts, you are very happy with your signing. <sighs> Everyone's starting. Okay, so you have Lady and Chaplick. Chaplick. One year, 1.4. You have Lady. Alright, five years. Whatever. Okay, let's just see real quick. Who's the most? Patterson, Besser, Keller, Hughes, Yovlani, Morrissey, Perenko, Hints, Hughes, Yamamoto, McLeod, Smith, Hoglander, Radish, Robertson, Frederick, Jefflick. So I hmm. Demko is now in 88. Alright, so. Very good. Very good. That's very good. Perrick is now in 86. Uh, 76, I mean, say. Di Pietro. 
Oh, so the five games he played, he actually did really good. That's very good. Can free me? Still only one. Yeah, I don't know. Should I trade one of these guys? Morrissey, actually Morrissey. I for Morrissey, I could trade Morrissey, but that's gonna be over the off season. All right, so guys, if you guys enjoyed that video, please like and subscribe. As I, as you guys may have seen, as you guys heard in the beginning of the video, I'm gonna be doing the off season off camera, so I tell you guys what happens in the next next season. So like, subscribe, share this video with your friends, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.